Hello and welcome to Wednesday's video. We are looking into um, what is the uh, penultimate day of the Showdown series. So we should have a different league um, involved in that. We've already had two Premier League, one Turkish League, one NWSL and one La Liga. So I'm imagining it will be German, French or Italian League next. We'll have a look at that in a minute. Obviously we will have a new Team of the Week today and maybe some more... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Some more for birthday stuff. But let's have a scroll through and see what we got. Obviously, we are 13 hours away from the end of the season. So we've got a new season coming tomorrow morning. Um, and we are still three days away from this, uh, which is Thursday, Friday, Saturday. There we go. So that's more Pro League watching stuff, just having on the background. NWSL countdown is there again more games with NWSL players which is fine easy uh, games to get um, random packs that we can enjoy from there ultimate day uh, ultimate birthday daily login upgrade completionist absolute word salad a completely up ultimate birthday daily login upgrade 15 times to get 15 packs so this like we always say it's just engagement stuff they want you to get involved and log in on a daily basis, so they put that there. So that's why it's there, and it will be there for as long as they need people just to log in. And there's more rival stuff there. Oh, okay, I didn't look at milestones. I need to look at milestones just in case. Just in case. Probably not going to be anything there, but correct. Nothing there. Right. Uh, let's go to moments. Why not? You need a sip two seconds. We have eight new ones there. I'm assuming nothing new here because of the proximity of the season and all that. Oops. Yeah, just the normal stuff there. Right, evolution. Will we have a new evolution? Most likely not. But let's check, just in case. You never know what might come out. No, we haven't. At all. Um, I managed to get... I got a Tavernier from the... Um, upgrade, uh, the icon, uh, icon Team of the Week upgrade SPC. And I got a Birgit Prince from the Icon SPC. So I've decided to upgrade them both. Cost me coins, but yeah, it's worth it. It's, it's good. Um... 94 rated striker will make her the highest rated player in my squad uh, club, which is good. And Tavernier at, at, at an 89 is decent as an English option. So, yeah, I thought, why not? Might as well do both of those. Go for them. So let's see what, see what we've got in the store, if anything good at all. Uh, normal things here that we had the other day that I looked at. Promo packs are the regular stuff that we are no interested in at all. Up to the 750 for the four special cards. Four wastes of money there. Packs for you, normal stuff, classic packs. And we're two and a half hours away from a refresh there. So nothing to open. So let's hope we've got at least 83 by 10 in the SPCs. Um, right, so players... Felix and Depay were yesterday. Why they're showing us loans on the icons uh, pages at the front, I'm not sure, but they are. Oh, they all are. Tadebo and then Tiedemans. Dabala, Bowen, Undev, Jota, Carvalho, Davidson Sanchez, Michael Delavira, Marius Wolf is new. Bruce Dortmund versus Eintracht Frankfurt. You would expect Dortmund to win that. So right back, right mid, and right wing back. Very even balanced card. Obviously volleys and penalties low. Everything else in the 70s, 80s, and a couple of things in the 90s. That crossing and that sprint speed and composure. Whip pass plus. Anticipate, jockey, technical, rapid, Travella and long throw. So a player with talent. To be honest, his dribbling is pretty decent. What would you want on that? I would probably put a backbone on it, to be honest. Boost that physical, that defending, and it will give it a nice boost to the passing and the vision. That's what I would go with myself. What is this squad going to cost for an 87 
Bundesliga German right back. It's an 84 rated squad. Considering that could go to an 89, that's not too bad. It's, yeah, to be honest, it's an 84 rated squad. You could get a duplicate couple of 84s or a duplicate 85 or something, and then it's suddenly a lot less. Get a duplicate team of the week. You want somewhere to put the card, you might as well use it there unless you're going for an SPC. At least this guarantees you a card that could rise. Then the other half is Ansgar Knauf. I'm probably butchering that name. I apologise. He is fast. He is a pure left... Is he a striker as well? Left wing, left mid, right wing and cam. Okay. Across the middle of the park there. Bad long passing, good short passing. Decent vision crossing, some shooting stats. Decent when he gets in the box. Dribbling is good, bar the composure. The composure sucks, unfortunately. Jumping and stamina are good, but the physical strength and aggression are low. Decent play styles, but nothing out of this world. I mean, Travella's useful, quick step and rapid plus are useful. Technical and first touch will help, but there's no shooting ones. Um, and relentless would have been good, to be honest, but... That composure at 75 is a little bit lower than you'd want. I would imagine this is a more attacking player, so you'd expect more expensive. But it's Frankfurt, so you'd expect him cheaper. So I'm going to guess he's going to be 84 with a team of the week or 85 without a team of the week. 85 with a team of the week. Okay. That's a little bit more expensive, so I'm surprised there. Let's just have a quick peek at the Bundesliga table. Is there something that I'm missing out? Bundesliga table. Okay, so we obviously have Leverkusen top. Uh, so Dortmund are fourth. And then Eintracht Frankfurt are actually sixth. They've lost... They've, yeah, lost five games and lost four games between them this season. So it could be pretty close. It's not a guaranteed by any stretch of the imagination. I apologise if I said earlier on that it should be a Dortmund win because clearly when they're fourth and sixth in the table and there's only how many points between them? Oh, Dortmund are actually seven points ahead, but sure, that won't be an easy match, I'm sure, at all. So that's what we've got there. These two players, Knauf as a winger and then... A wolf as a right back. So upgrades, uncle icon as well. Uh, like I said, I've done a, a couple more since. I got a uh, the Birgit Prince, which was the main one. Obviously, quite happy with a ninety four rated player. But I also got um, Essien as an eighty six. Uh, Michael Owen as an eighty nine, which is not great, but it is what it is. Campaign bag still there, 87 plus, hero still there. Ultimate birthday daily login upgrade. This is surely got to be a bronze, just a single bronze player. Yeah, it is cool. Wait, these have changed as, oh my word, you can put loans off. That's brilliant. So when you're picking a squad of players for anything to play games, you can turn the loany players off, so the ones you've got. The ones you don't own. That's brilliant. They should have done that years ago. Daily gold, daily silver, daily bronze update. We've got the 83 by 10, which we'll do one of now, and we'll do the other two later on this evening. Uh, what? Oops. Obviously, loans are off automatically here because you're exchanging a squad, and therefore you can't exchange somebody that you don't actually own, which is why. That's there. So we've got 83... Got an 83, got an 83. I just need to turn the rares on, don't I? Um, 81, 81, 81. So, 85? Don't want to put it? I don't think so. Um, we've obviously still got a team of the week to look at. Um, we should have another challenge SBC as well over in the next tab or so. We just need a couple of 83s, 82s here. Um, 84, he's there. Oh, this will do. And Hala. 
Oh, we're on there. So can we do an 82 to Where's Hoiberg gone? There he is. Oops. Oh, we were smack on. Let's put Galton in instead of Mancini. So we did that with 481s as well. That's pretty good. And Hoiberg, which nobody cares about, to be honest. Um, normal upgrades, 80 plus. 80. So yeah, all the normal things are there as per yesterday. Uh, the 83 plus player pick was there again. And the daily showdown. We'll do the Spanish League as we pretty much do every day, I think. I think I've found since. But it always seems to work. So let's try today. Do we work? Oh, we're short of a couple of rares. So we need one at left back. Becker up top. And Morales, oops, Morales up top, I see on the bench there. There we go, that works. Cool, so we've got two packs to open. So, any icons? Pajo Calavaro, Jorginho, Yashin, no. And exchanges are still there. Yesterday, I put um, like five or six 87 and 88 rated players into here and took the packs out of it, and it was a good option. I managed to put um, some of the the outcomes into player... Uh, uh, I did player picks from the other thing, from the outcomes, which boosted the amount of players I had available in my squad, and then I was able to do a couple of the icon things, which obviously didn't turn out brilliantly, but could have. Um, and yeah, just did a couple of SPCs, some just generally boosted my club, and it's the best way when you've got a high-rated player like that randomly that comes out of an SPC, even if it's just a special card like a Deli Alley, a purple one that you don't want, you can put that straight into the exchange, and then that jumps up the amount of players in your squad and it's the one what well, was the main way to increase the number of players in your squad because everything else that you do gives you less players that you put than you put in apart from the exchange so it's it's definitely a good thing within the game i didn't even we need to look at team of the week first and then i'll open the packs right so squad battles team of the week so we have a 93 harry kane 89, Modric, 88, Aubameyang, Goetze and Pereo. Only Kane has got the double playstyle plus. All the rest have got singular playstyles. Oh my word, it actually vaguely loads for once. Let's try that again. Okay, so bench is Vertonghen, Demba Bay, Lee dong Stock Stock Huanmi, Chikamat. Jakumakis and Sims, who got a hat trick, I know that. They're not outstanding at all. Anana in goal, fair enough. I'm not sure what he did last month. They lost to Fulham, they lost to Man City. Drew Man City, lost to Man City. Then we've got a Perry at left back. Left back, left wing back, lots of pace, lots of defending. Needs an backbone. Otherwise, you're wasting that pace. He's got slide tackle plus, like Juan Bissaka. Acrobatic as well. How tall is he? Six foot. That's decent enough. Bissek, obviously, who's doing well at Inter Milan this year. Very well-rounded dribbling. Good passing. Very good physicals. Top strength and jumping. Got block and jockey plus. And aerial ones as well. How tall is he? Six five. He's going to be decent in the air. Ben White, four-star weak foot, ticker tacker plus, long ball, intercept, block, and press proven. Fair enough. That's a solid enough card. And centre-back as well. That works quite well then. Then we've got Prunella Harder, Panea, Panella Harder. Right mid, Cam, right wing, and striker. Good composure. Bomb heavy dribbling is a favourite of mine. Passing is good. Needs a hunter or a hawk. Either of those would work well on her. Then we've got Mr. Modric. Lovely card to use. Like butter with the dribbling. Travella plus. Technical. Ping. Finesse. Whipped. Everything. Yeah. That's a nice card. The composure, the agility, the balance, the ball control, the passing. Yeah, that's still a good card. 
We like that. Gets a five star weak foot, left mid, cam and centre forward. See Frank yeah, Frank first, so he's involved in the showdown with uh, Bristol Dortmund. Ball control at ninety six, composure at ninety three gives you a Modric style card, except this guy's got better stamina, better volleys, better attacking positioning, all sorts of things. Press proven and first touch plus. Tick attacker as well and technical as well. Nice. Cooper Myers, that means he's going to pop much less often than he normally does because I get his goal card regularly. Centre mid, Cam and centre defensive midfielder. Two star weak for and great. Then you've got a Bamiang who is pure pace. Oh, he's got a similar pace to the other guy. That 85-90 odd split. Paraleo. 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 Attacking positioning is a little low, but pace is high, agility is high, composure is low, and aggression is low. Tick attack of plus, rapid, or oh, quick step, sorry. <sighs> Nothing hugely special. And then the cane, five star weak foot, still needs the pace boost, it needs an agility boost, so potentially an engine. Power header plus. Incisive pass plus, power shot, Traveller, aerial, press proven, first touch. They're all pretty good, but I'd want Kane, Modric or Bisek there, I think. Those are the ones I would go for there. Let's quickly go back. I know I spent too long on that, but let's go back. We'll do the 83 by 10 and then leave it there. Um, so yeah, overall we've got Team of the Week 26. We've got the Bundesliga showdown between Wolf and Knauf. Um, the... Daily Showdown Challenge, which we completed quickly. The Daily Login Ultimate Birthday SPC, which is the bronze. Then we've got the 83 plus player pick, which is back for the repeated ones. And then the 83 by 10, which we're about to open our first of. Come on, get a special card for once. No, we're not. We are a normal gold. Uh, so yeah, I will wish you good luck with your picks, with your packs and with your play tonight. Obviously, some people will be finishing off their Division Rivals games before tomorrow, the rewards. So we've got Pop and Mainyan there, which is a decent outcome. I may, like I said before, put them both into the um, exchange to get a multitude of players out of them to do the player picks. Let's see what else we've got in this pack. Oh, Cooper Myers as well. I even joked about him popping as well, and he bloody did. Well done, well done. He's going to go straight into next SPC. And then we got Maracio, Mar Mar who I almost put into this SPC. So, yeah, that's a decent first pack. We will reuse and recycle and go again. So, yeah, thank you very much for watching, clicking, subscribing, um, putting up with me, rambling on. And I will end the video there. Thank you very much indeed. And I'll speak to you this time tomorrow. All being well. Thank you and goodbye.